Well, hey guys, I've gotten a lot of requests to do a video on the 2014 Ford Fiesta, and I came across this titanium sedan here. So I thought I would go ahead and take an opportunity to show it to you guys. Um, so we'll go ahead and start off with the window sticker. That way I know what this car is all about. Let's see. This one has is the 2014 four-door sedan, titanium, five passenger, 1.6 liter uh, engine, and the six-speed automatic transmission, Oxford white and medium light stone leather interior. And this one's kind of, this is different. Uh, if you want to read that, you can pause it. It basically says this vehicle was selected for road testing following assembly. So uh, yeah, this one stickers for 20,090. Optional equipment is the six-speed automatic, which stickers for 1095, and that's basically the only option on this one. Uh, titanium has come pretty much fully loaded. So we'll go ahead and start off with the front end, which is where my main complaint with the new uh, Fiesta is. Now, some people call my Fusion a pissed-off catfish. I'm sorry, but no, it's not. This new Fiesta is the royal definition of pissed off catfish, whiskers and all. It, I mean, I like it somewhat, but I think that the front end, the grill is pushed too far out from the rest of the car. Like, the car should end about here, but then you have this much more just for the grill. Like, you know, that's not necessary. Um, I just, I just don't, I don't really like that. It looks a little too guppy-ish or something, I don't know. But uh, here you have the standard halogen headlamps, no HIDs or projector beams on the titanium, sadly. I think they should have at least given you H or projector beams. You do have fog lamps down below, which is nice. This one also has a front license plate bracket because I live in Texas and Texas is stupid that way. For the rims, let's see, what do we have? 195.50 R16s, so 16 inch rims, lots of spokes. Looks kind of obnoxious to clean, personal, or in my personal opinion. These little fins right here, which I assume serve some kind of fuel economy purpose. Turn signals on the mirrors, they're not LEDs, they're just um, regular bulbs. This one does have smart key access, as you can see. Wait, did that just flash at me? No, it didn't, dang it. This one does have smart key access, as you can see by the little button right here. No smart key on the rear doors. Taking a look inside, the steering wheel is carried over. As you can see, this one does have leather, and the titanium includes a center armrest for the driver and passenger. Six-speed or power shift automatic, which is basically a dual clutch. Um, there's your automatic headlamp controls, as well as fog lamps. And the gauges are now blue instead of red. There's your push-button start right there. Um, See, you can see this one does have the Sony stereo with a shrunken down version of the My Ford touch screen. Here's your fuel filler door right here. Typical Ford, no fuel cap. They also did revise the tail lights a little bit for 2014. Um, you can see, let me see if I can find a 20, I don't see a 2013 sedan around. Um, but it's whatever. It looks mm, better, I guess. I don't know. I wasn't really a fan of the Fiesta to begin with, so I don't know. It's okay, but it's just a little small for me. And another complaint, Garrison, I know you've pointed this out too, but the titanium badge looks way too big for the back of these. Um, even on the hatchback, it looks a little bit big, in my personal opinion. Uh, you, this one does have reverse parking sensors as well as a rear backup camera, so that's nice that they give you that. I wasn't expecting those kind of features. You have got to be kidding me. Like, really? Wow. This one does not have blind spot information system or anything like that. You can see the little fisheye mirror there. Um, looking in the back seat is rather tiny. Um, it, there's not a whole lot of room and the driver's seat looks adjusted about where I would want it and it looks rather tiny You have a 12 volt power outlet right down there though, so that's nice um, They also did change over the shift knob to the one that you they're using on the Fiat or the focus and the fusion now So that's nice um, Brings it more upscale, I guess But anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed this little overview on the 2014 Ford Fiesta Not my personal favorite car 
that Ford makes. I wish the front end was a little less pissed off catfish-ish. Catfish-ish, if you follow what I'm saying. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed, and thanks for watching.